Hey guys, thank you for joining me and welcome back. So today I'm going to be creating two candle holders or candle vases. I'm going to be using some items I picked up from my local thrift store and from the Dollar Tree. So I'm going to be using some gems that I picked up from Amazon and I'm going to leave the link to as many things as I can find today in the description section. So check there if you're interested. Also today guys, to adhere the gems to the vases, I'm going to be using the double-sided mounted tape, which is very, very sticky. You're gonna see me use that today and I'm gonna tell you a little bit about that when I use it. But anyway guys, so this is the project I'm gonna be working on today. It came out absolutely beautiful. Guys, please don't forget to thumbs up the video. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and I'm going to get started. So this large, bowl I picked up from my discount store the smaller one I picked up from the Dollar Tree and the two scalloped edge bowls there I picked those up from my thrift store I picked up four of those and the smaller dish I found at the thrift store as well so in another video guys I made this beautiful uh, dish this kind of like a candy dish or a candle dish I made that out of this bowl that you see here. So I made this earlier in another video just to show you that I, I picked up a few of those bowls and those are really nice. So guys, I'm gonna get started. I'm going to clean all the glassware really well with a paper towel and some alcohol. So I'm just gonna run through and clean everything I'm going to use today. So what I'm going to do here is just adhere the smaller bowl to the larger bowl and I'm going to let that dry for 24 hours. After that, I'm going to adhere the two smaller bowls together and I'm going to let everything dry for 24 hours. So guys, now it's the next day and everything is dry and set into place. I'm going to use this bridal chain that I picked up from Amazon as well as the double sided mounted tape. So guys, the tape is extremely sticky and it's very, very difficult to work with. So I'm going to give you a fair warning. To pull the tape away from the roll, I find it easy to use uh, silicone tweezers. This tape does not stick to silicone tweezers, so I'm going to be using that to help pull the tape away. The, I like this tape a lot, guys. It's a little bit stronger than hot glue, and hot glue is not going to hold the chain to this uh, vase that I created today, so I'm going to use the double-sided tape, which works really well. I've used this tape in other projects, and it works extremely well, and it holds very well. It's just gonna stick, guys, it sticks immediately. I would not use this tape to adhere anything to your walls. This tape is very strong and it will pull away your paint and your plaster. So I only use this tape for crafting items to adhere gems to glass bases. Works really well for that. Other than that, guys, I do use a stronger glue or I use my hot glue gun. But anyway, so this is how I'm going to apply this today in this video. And guys, this works really, really well.
guys I really like the way this came out that one is really sort of simple in design not overly decorated but I love the way they both came out and uh, let me know what you think about that double-sided mounted tape guys I'm interested in your thoughts on that but anyway guys thank you so much for joining me I do appreciate it please don't forget to thumbs up this video please don't forget to subscribe and with that said guys you stay well stay safe and stay blessed and I will see you at the next video bye-bye